Well, good day, fishermen. Welcome back to some deep sea fishing action with Bill's T Max. Well, we're gonna go do some more fishing today. Uh, I've done a little bit, a couple of trips back and forth, and uh, we made ourselves a little bit of money, which isn't too bad. I just haven't, I haven't really done much upgrades to the boat since uh, we played last week. But um, anyways, she's, she's kind of getting nighttime dark. But let's do our shopping here. Um, I found. Uh, let's just go back over here for a second. I found that. Um, what do I want? Oh, I want the map. I found that you can catch haddock and pollock on the mackerel bait, and it seems to work really good. The last haul we got, uh, we we actually did really well. I did over 40 grand. Uh, let's look at the logbook here. So I've tried a bit of crab and stuff, and it eh, didn't do tremendous. Mostly shrimp to start here. Last week we used a lot of shrimp, and uh, not terribly too bad. But mackerel, we did really well. We got a lot of mackerel here. Um, Pollock, Pollock's the the high paying one. We did pretty good on the Pollock, so. Uh, we're going to do another run here, so let's go to the grocery cart here. And as you can see, our cod's actually paying up pretty good, too, but Pollock's still decent. But uh, you can actually, apparently when you get further along, you can actually uh, catch your own mackerel, make your own bait, so I'm like, that's cool. So I haven't upgraded any lines yet. Could buy a 500 hook line for 20 grand. Oh, that seems like a lot. Ooh, 40 grand for that one. A thousand hook. You know what? I'm gonna. Oh, can I now though? Only a maximum of four lines. Okay. So I just take one of those off and add one of those. Hey, there we go. Ching. Oh, there goes the money. <laughs> but a thousand. A thousand, so that's going to cost a lot to bait that. But we're going to bait everything with mackerel. Oh, that took her down quite a bit. <laughs> okay, uh, we've got fuel. I, no, I don't want that. I did fuel when I come back. Um, we're gonna try something different today. And, uh, you actually burn up, they say, I was reading in the wiki there, 50% more fuel if you fast travel. So we're going to fast travel, but we're gonna fast travel in a different way. So, let's, uh, let's get off the dock here first. I'm gonna have to back out of here. Oh, jeez. Hitting my haul already. That's not good. So, full of fuel, we're all, re well, mostly was repaired. It's, uh, just turning nighttime, but it's, this game is really funny with the colors. Okay, so let's get whipping out here while we're going. We're going to look at a good place for Pollock and Haddock. Pollock is good there. Haddock's not. I think I'm going to try to aim for here. For the Haddock. And then we can drop two lines in for the Pollock. Maybe here. It's not tremendously great. But uh, we could do Haddock here. Maybe around the corner. Pollock's better here maybe. It's actually pretty good in this little bay right here. Maybe we'll drop a couple lines in the bay and then go around the corner and do the haddock there. Okay, well, let's set a waypoint for about there. So we've got 4.9 kilometers. Now, like I said, I was going to fast travel. But I'm going to fast travel a little bit different way. And uh, once we get out past the little berm thingy here, I'm going to show you how we're going to do this. Make sure we 
pretty much lined up there right now, so why don't we uh, fast travel now? Now, there, I won't be doing any narration while we're fast traveling, as you'll see right now. All right, we are fast time. That's pretty awesome, eh? Uh, it's dark, I know, but uh, it's nighttime, so I can't do much about it. My lights on this boat absolutely suck. <laughs> but anyways. Um, okay, so I don't know what this is coming up here. I gotta go over this way anyways. It's my marker, beacon, waypoint thing there. I don't know what the heck those are. <laughs> um, anyways, let's throttle back here a little bit. Get, have a look at our map here again. And yeah, okay, so we got to go a little more left. Okay, so this is going to be our haddock here. Nope, sorry, Pollock. And I think I'm going to drop my two lines here, my short lines. And. Okay, hang on. So this, okay, so this is the Pollock here. Pollock and a bit of Haddock. So yeah, okay, I'm going to drop my two, sh two short lines here. I'll take my longer line up the other, around the corner here. Okay, so we need to go actually this way a little bit. I don't know what those are. It's like fish farm thingies or something in there, maybe. I'm not sure. Alright, let's open up our net fishing stuff. We're gonna we're gonna drop two of these guys here. Play I'm in the circle. Just starting in the circle, but that's okay. Right, they're in soaking. We'll uh, head a little bit more this way, maybe. Eh, 
And while these are in soaking, I will take a little break. Um, let that soak. There's no real fast time for that on this game, which kind of sucks. I mean, you could drive back through your waypoints if you wanted, but that really does just kind of waste. I hope there's something here, not just, just showing these tank things. Cause, yeah, their tanks are like right about here, or whatever those things are. So, anyways, I'm gonna drop my next one here. Hopefully, these lines don't come up empty. Cause that would suck. All right, throttle up. We'll head around the corner here. That we were going for the haddocks around the corner, so yeah, I'm gonna start. Uh, boy, oh boy, I don't know. I want to start a short line maybe through here, or maybe do my two lines right here. Maybe I'll do the long one, turn around and do that guy, maybe. Okay. So we'll just keep rolling here. I guess it's not going to be super too long. I just wish it wasn't so bloody dark out here. But uh, I guess we'll be harvesting or bringing up the lines in the, in the light. So that's a good thing. And then hopefully we'll be going back to port in the light too. Be uh, would be alright too. I wouldn't mind that. I got this light here, but it's just phenomenally crappy, and I don't even think you can turn it. It's just so bright. Okay, let's remove that, and uh, yeah, we're gonna start. there and run the long one. Roughly. Hopefully there's a little bit of fish there. Because fish that pay are good for our, our money. I have driven enough kilometers now to... Uh, get into the next boat. Should look at that uh, quickly here under the certs. So we can get this little guy here now, but uh, man, I need like a lot of money. <laughs> so let's see how much I've driven now. Officially driven 75.8, so that's pretty cool. It's 120 to the next guy, which will be not for a wee bit, but I've never done one of these big long lines, so this is going to be really cool. Hopefully there's a whole whack of fish on it, but hopefully i got enough room to hold all this, or I will have to run back to port. That would kind of suck. Well, I've done... I've, I've actually not uh, harvested or brought up four full lines yet. One line always seems to be, oh, no fish were caught. Like, yeah, well, I, I doubt that, but okay. All right, let's just double check here. Yeah, so we're looking pretty good here. As soon as we hit this marker, I think we'll... Will we start right there? Yeah. Okay, let's get the long line out. Oh, 100 meters. Ooh, wee, this is a big feller. Probably should have gone into that circle a little more, but it's bigger out here than you think. That's a long line, though. That's really, really 
pulling in there good. I wish I was pulling this way a little more though. a lot longer than I'm used to. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, the lines are so short. Awesome. Okay, where the heck are we? Okay, we're gonna go this way a little more, and I think I'm just gonna drop the next one up this way a little bit. Keep them apart a little bit. Not a whole lot, but some. Last line, going in the water. All right. We are wet. And uh, I'm just going to zip back to the other line because they should technically be done first. And uh, hopefully she's getting a bit brighter by the time we get back to pulling these out. When they're ready to pull out, we'll pull them out. <laughs> so we'll be back. Uh, it's going to take me a little while, though. You guys, unfortunately, or fortunately for you guys, sorry, it'll be uh, microseconds. But uh, for me, it's probably about an hour. I got well, I'm not quite an hour. Maybe about 30 minutes. I got to sit here and, and uh, you know, watch it. So well, we better do a save career. So I don't know if you have noticed yet, but we renamed our boat. So that's kind of cool. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to zip back to uh, these other lines and uh, we'll catch you back here in a minute or two. Alrighty, looks like we've got some green. I think that means go. I think it's at 18 to 24 hours you can pick them up again. So I've been parked over by these big round circle things. I I, I don't know what they are. <laughs> if they're like a fish farming thing or or some kind of netting capture thing. I don't know. But anywho, let's get over to our first line. It's kind of I was parked beside it, and I'm like, ah, oh, let's go look at what those things are, but I don't really know. Maybe it's something I'll get into later on or something, uh, fishing-wise. But our first string is here. I don't believe our other one will be ready. Oh, it is ready, too. Ooh. Okay, we better get over there, too, then, after. This shouldn't take too long. Let's pull it in here. Cross some fingers, hopefully we get a good haul. Yeah, I must say the graphics really aren't the best in this, but you do, you know, there's waves, like currents and red waves and stuff, so that's kind of cool. Yes. Okay, come on, fish. Six on this line. That's not good. Well, I don't exactly know what that means. There's only six on the line. Because when you when we look at the thing here after, there'll be quite a few fish we've caught. The trouble with this is it's not to scale of what we actually catch. So that's only what six fish we're bringing in here. Okay, but then look at our, our list after we caught 24 Pollux, <laughs> 8 uh, Haddocks, and 2 Redfish. Okay, the next line, put up right beside that thing there almost, so hopefully it's good. And around the bend. So far, our boat's not showing very much. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, it's weird. There's like a weird haze on the water here. It's not too far further out, but here it's there's a little weird haze. Yes. Come on, fish. Eight bursts, whatever that means on this line. Oh, perfect. I'm not sure what the percentage means. I'll research that too. Seven Pollock in that line. That's good. That's the one that pays the money. Uh, so I'm not um, getting fish. Um, if we look at our logbook here, What's that now? sales. Um, Got the last bunch, but I'm, I'm, I was actually losing money. Like here, I lost 16% on the sale for gutting because I sucked at it so bad. It's just so stupid. Like, like here, I lost 33%. 30, like that's a lot of money I'm losing. So you actually don't lose money if you don't gut them. You just don't. You would get more if you did gut them. But um, because I'm not losing money, technically I'm not losing money. Not, uh, I'm not bothering the gut. Not unless gutting gets better later on, but oh man, that's just like... Well, if I don't gut, I don't lose money, but if I do gut and I screw it up, then I lose money. You know, and I, I just find their gutting system here really silly. <laughs> With those, like, weird magnet thingies, I, I don't... I don't really get it, but I see the weird haze here, and I've turned off that bloom effect too. I've got everything as best as it can get, so hopefully they give the game a little bit of a graphical update. You know, we're playing games in 2018 now. This is like a game from 1996, <clears throat> graphic-wise. So. Man, those two lines only quarter filled our boat. Hopefully, this big long line here's got something real good on it. Fingers are crossed. So, looks like we might be going back in when it's getting dark. Maybe we should be leaving port when it's dark. Or midnight or something like that. And then, uh, coming back. Now, where the heck did my lines go? Oh, there was still quite a piece of But yeah, if you if you fast travel, wow, you lose you lose a lot of fuel real fast. It says it uses 50% more than if you actually just drove it. So I like the way we're doing our fast travel. It's kind of neat. It's like super speedboat. discovered one port. Uh, it's funny enough, I actually went to this one, discovered this one. Um, but the one that's across from our bay, I haven't discovered that one yet. So one of these days we'll do the fast, fast high-speed drive. We'll <laughs> find this one, and uh, there's one way over there. I don't, I, I don't know if I could make it there on one tank, though. I could probably get maybe from here to probably about here and then that would be it so and then there's one way up here I could probably get to this guy here though so we'll definitely need a bigger boat I think to get over there Wish we could take fuel with us you know and just not just in the tank fuel 
I don't know, if we actually drove it and, you know, did our fast time driving, we might actually, we might actually make that port over there. And we have to drive it anyways, because you have no fast, fast, real fast, normal fast time over there, because we haven't discovered it yet. And I've noticed too, like right now we're only doing 9.10 knots there. We must be going against the wind a little bit or something. Because I think I've had up to 14 and a half knots, which we might get on the way back. That might be nice. funny if you just let your, your ship go, your boat go, you, uh, you actually start drifting all over the place. You really have to be on the wheel there to keep it going in your course if you want. Oh, why is that blue now? It was green. Oh, is that not a good thing? line here, so I'd really like to, to have a read on that, but maybe I'll just throttle back a little bit. We'll just have a little quick little read here. Uh, line fishing. Okay, so stay minimum four hours. <clears throat> the best time to haul has been 18 to 24 hours. Okay, so we're within that. Blue best result. That's kind of weird. You'd think you'd make green the best result, but anyways. Blue is best result. Okay, good to, good to know. So this is our long line here. This is going to be awesome. Hopefully we can get all this fish in here. This is our super long line. Can't wait. Hopefully it doesn't say, oh, there was no fish caught. Oh. Oh, please don't say that. Here we go. Oh, there's fish on. That's good. Only one of 11, though. Oh, no. I was expecting more like 30. Maybe we'll catch a whole bunch here. See, I got perfect there, but only 5%. Does that mean a 5% loss? That was good, so I got an 8% loss? I, I don't understand. I'll have to read, maybe that's something with you. It says plus 8%, though. So you get a bonus, maybe. That's a big one. Let's see, plus 14%. Maybe that's giving you more fish. 17%. See, that was plus 17% too, though, when it was gone past. So 97 Pollock! Oh, yeah, that's awesome. And Haddock, those are the best best two payers right there. Okay. We, we are almost full. <laughs> I would say we got about a quarter left. Ooh, excited. This is awesome. Oh, there's whales up here. Looking things up here, a whale. Let's see if we can see a whale or two. They, they say in this game, if you see whales, that's good because there's lots of fish around, but I would almost think the opposite. Though. The whales have eaten all the fish and there's nothing left. After we catch these guys, bring them in, we'll go over and see if we can see a whale. Those are whales. 
kind of hanging out. Eating all my fish, probably. You watch, I bet you there's nothing on this line. Back her up, Fred. Got a bit too close, I guess. Why can't I pick this one up? Let's try that again. Maybe it's not ready. It's blue, though. That's not very good. Come on, boat. Huh. Oh. For some reason, the arrow is pointing to that end. That's weird, because this is the way I set it. Actually, it would be that end you'd pick up again, but... You now it's pointing down there. What the crap? Try this one. Oh, that one's fine. That's weird. Okay, hopefully we get a full boat. Oh, one of eleven. That's really good. Oh, three percent. That's not good. Good thing I bought that extra storage. I need more storage. Oh, man. I don't want to spend too much on this boat. I want to get into the next boat. Oh, perfect. It's a very fine line before you lose it. Time has passed, and our whales are way over there. Oh, let's go have a look at them. I do have fish on. Oh, we didn't get quite a full load. Not not too far off, though. But yeah, those those whales are not too far away. Maybe we'll catch some on the way back to port here. Well, let's get our nose pointed into port, and then we'll do our hyper speed back. It's a little further away, but 5.7 kilometers. We're gonna have to really fast travel this one. Okay, let's let's get at her. Okay, we must be really fighting a current here or something, or some wind or something. We're only doing, like, not quite four knots. Holy crap. So I think I might actually just fast, fast travel here, because that's going to take uh, about an hour to get back in here. Um, so, yeah, we must be really fighting something good there. Now it's going to tell us we're going to hit that thing, so we're going to have to go to here. 
and uh, let's just uh, let's just fast travel that because holy cow, that's I don't mind if it's going up good speed to do the, our our fast travel, but that's horrible. <laughs> I couldn't fight that all day. Okay, so let's see how much more fuel we use away. Ooh, hungry. So our fish are still pretty good. We you get up to eight days to get rid of them. So after 14 days, not so that's, that's a long time. Okay, why am I not turning? There we go. So we'll get in here and sell our fish. And uh, why am I consistently not turning? On my boat. Yeah, even in here, I'm like, maybe because I'm so heavy, that's why. That makes sense. Okay, so maybe we'll have to remember that. So when we're bringing a big load of fish in, <laughs> we'll have to fast travel it. But we'll drive out and do our fast travel on the way out. Oh, this is going to be awesome then. If it slows the boat down that much. Yes, I would like to dock. How much are we gonna get? Oh my goodness, we got 60 grand just for the Pollock. Holy crap, 60, 70, 71 minus 71, it's about 73,000. Oh, that was a good haul. Sweet. So our net income, wait a minute, what's going on here? Okay, I'm not sure how their pricing is working here. Revenue is 44 plus port reputation. We gain another 1897. That's pretty good. All right. Well, the reputation went up quite a bit there. That's good. Um. Now, map is up here. Everything moves around. Let's look up here. Map. Where is a good place to go now? Looks like about the same place. It hasn't changed much. But, um... I don't know if I want to try in the same spot exactly, though. Yeah, the Pollock's not very good there, so... Maybe we'll do a little venture and go out around here, discover this port. I could discover that one, I guess it's right across the bay from us, but maybe if we discover that one it might open up another fishing area. I don't I don't know if it will or not, but let's uh let's set course and we'll do a fast travel maybe around the island here. Um so let's don't uh, should I bait my hooks here maybe? Maybe I will. We'll, uh, we'll bait everything with mackerel again. Uh, so that one will get mackerel. Because mackerel does seem to work really good there. Okay, that ate up our money pretty quick. <laughs> oh, 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 wait a sec. We need uh, fuel. Fix our haul. Okay, now we can go fishing. Haul damage was from when we left the port before, remember that? Hit the dock there a hair bit. Okay, so we'll get out here. Can set our course here from here. Let's we'll see if we can sneak through here or something. yet that's right I keep forgetting well because we're outside of our searched area there so we'll just have to go manually I guess out there it's nice to see the distance so up on the flags but um, okay so once we get out here well, I guess we could do it here even let's start, start our fast travel here
All right, so we are nearly there. That was a long journey just around, around the corner, basically. Hopefully I can get through here, all right. Might be a little shallow, but I think, I think we'll make it 25 meters. Between the, boat, the, the buoys here. Okay, so let's go back to our map. I'm just, just curious how, how shallow it was here. Looks like we got lots of room. And just got to go in and around this little jut out that's just in behind there. Now, hopefully, this opens up a big circle around here when we discover this. I, I don't know whether it does or not, but I mean, I was checking the fish finder as we're going there, and I'm seeing nothing. So I think you actually have to discover this and discovers that area. But I'm not sure what happens way out. Like, like there's lots of water here. Like. But I don't know how you discover all that. There's one point coming around. Um, right around this bend here. Man, I dropped to like 21 frame a second. I don't I don't know why, but something it didn't like around there anyway, so here I'm down to 24, 26 frame a second. Quite a bit in frame rate, really. Well, that's not good. Oh, there's our there's our port right there. Well, hopefully this unlocks, like I say, a big circle of this man. That's a long drive to get all the way back around. Because I can't fast travel. I will still say it's undiscovered. So here's hoping, but we didn't use that much fuel. That wasn't too bad that way. Yay! That's... wow. Tide must be out. Okay, so what is this now? Oh, a new guy. I can't hire people on this boat. Apparently it's not big enough. circle for us? It didn't. Oh, I kind of thought it would have opened up like one of these, but oh no. <laughs> oh, I gotta drive all the way back around. Yeah, I'd like to just go on the trailer maybe, but see, I can't even remove those waypoints for some weird reason. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Never mind. Okay, so See, it's not going to let me just plunk those down. Oh, maybe it will. Oh, that would save me a lot of messing about. Because I don't know now how I discover... don't know now how I discover another big circle like that, so. So we're going to fast travel back to the port, I guess, that we know. And uh, that's going to probably eat up all our fuel. We'll probably only get to about 12 and our fuel will be gone. So I better... Filler up here. Only use 28 liters coming around. Though. That's pretty good. Okay. Oh, it's still not gonna let me. Oh no. It's still not gonna let me fast travel that. You can draw the point on, but. Why wouldn't it let me fast travel that? Oh no, I'm gonna have to drive all the way back. 
Uh, or, oh, or open up my last in game. I guess I could save it here. Oh, I like that was. I should have saved before I left port there. Um, let's save this here. Just in case. And we'll load this last career. Yeah, see, we haven't even caught our fish here, so. <laughs> Oops. So that's not going to work. I'll just have to. I'll drive back on uh, on my own there. Yeah, that's what I'll have to do, I guess. But uh, anyways, I'll do that. Get ready for next week, and then uh, I don't know. We'll just have to keep fishing where we uh, where we are from there, I guess. So. But anyways, thanks again for watching. Have a good one, and we'll catch you next week. We're gonna do some more fishing.